Good morning and a hearty welcome to the 75th Independence Day celebration of our glorious nation, Azadi Ka Amrit Mahal, sir. We begin with a flag hoisting ceremony, which will be followed by a cultural fiesta by the students of class three. All are requested to rise for flag hoisting. Punjab, Sindh, Gujarat, Maratha, Dravida, Uttkala, Vanga, Vindya, Himachal, Yamuna, Ganga, Uchala, Jaladhi, Taranga, Tava, Shubha, Name, Jage, Tava, Shubha, Aashish, Maage, Gahe, Tava, Jaya, Gatha, Janagana Mangala Dayaka Jayahe Bharata Bhagya Vidhata Jayahe 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 Jaya 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 Jayahe Now let's move on to the cultural program prepared by the children of class three. Sit back and enjoy. Today, 15 August, is the Independence Day of our beloved motherland. And we have gathered here to celebrate this day and to remind ourselves of our duties and responsibilities and our ancestors' sacrifices. Therefore, I, Advit Artusha, and Vitika Anis warmly welcome you to our special assembly on behalf of our entire DPS Column family. Bless us, dear God, and our school today. In all we do and work or play, keep us in thy loving care and guide us to wisdom, kindness, and prayer. Thank you, Siddharth. We cordially welcome our honorable chief guest of today, Sri Sanjay Kaul, a retired IAS officer and member of managing committee of DPS column. Please allow me to introduce him to you. Mr. Sanjay Khan is a former Indian Administrative Service Officer. His vast experience of over 40 years encompasses leadership roles in the government, corporate and NGO sectors. After taking voluntary retirement from the IAS, he joined National Collateral Management Services Limited NCML, the country's leading agribusiness company, as its MD and CEO from 2008 to 2019. He currently serves as its chairman and as an independent director on several companies. In the IAS, he led challenging assignments, including health, food, and education sectors. And in the Prime Minister's office, in the education sector, Mr. Call has served as Commissioner Schools and Secretary School Education in the Government of Karnataka. After completing his Master's in Economics, from Delhi School of Economics, Carl began his career in 1976 as a lecturer at Delhi University. Mr. Carl has been actively engaged with NGOs in the health, nutrition and education sectors. He is closely associated with mobile crushes. 
a leading NGO which supports young underprivileged children and has served as its chairperson. A regular speaker at industry conferences, Mr. Cole's area of, of interest are agriculture, food and nutrition, education, health and poverty related issue. Sir, we request you to say a few words to the gathering. Dear DPS Kolam, boys and girls, teachers, principal Chatterjee, management committee members and friends, I am delighted to address you on the occasion of India's 75th Independence Day. It was 74 years ago that Pandit Jawaharlal Nehru hoisted the tricolor on the ramparts of the Red Fort in Delhi as India gained our political freedom from British rule. On this occasion, we remember with pride the leaders of our freedom movement, Gandhiji, Netaji Subhash Chandra Bose, Bhagat Singh, Sardar Patel, Maulana Azad, Nehruji, amongst many men and women who struggled and fought a unique non-violence movement to earn our country's freedom. In the past 74 years, the country has made huge strides in several areas. Agriculture, heralded by the Green Revolution, defense, industry, science, engineering and technology, education and overall economic growth, making India the fifth largest economy in the world. However, while the country has attained political freedom, around 30% of the country's population is still deeply mired in poverty and are yet to gain economic freedom. Let us today give a thought to their benefit, to their benefit and well-being. Alleviating poverty is perhaps the greatest challenge for India as it moves forward to celebrate 75 years of its independence. While I look forward to visiting DPS Kolam and meeting all of you, I have seen and read from videos, pictures and reports on the great progress made by DPS Kolam. I take this occasion to heartily congratulate all of you on the stellar achievements made by the school. It is especially heartwarming that despite the COVID pandemic and the consequent closure of the school, all of you have kept up your activities with a lot of dedication and enthusiasm. I know this has not been easy and reflects the scholastic and overall environment that exists in the school. I have no hesitation to say that DPS Kolam has the potential to become one of the leading schools not only in Kerala but all of India. DPS Kolam must strive to not only excel in academics but also equally in sports and extracurricular activities. I urge all boys and girls to make the best use of the excellent sports infrastructure and the arts and music infrastructure available and make the country proud. I also urge each of you to give a thought to the boys and girls from poor households who have not had the opportunity to get the best education and finding ways to help and support them. Congratulations again to all of you. Wish you all the very best. Thank you. Jai Hind. You, sir, for your kind words. We humbly invite our chairman, Mr. Abdul Aziz, to say a few words. Good morning. In the Bharatira and Namanadam, Valare Sandosha Tinde, Uri Dinaman in Namanadam, Abushikina, Jajim in the Swathandra Tinde, Elvati and Jama the Varshika Dinam. Avashigal. 
പവന ഭവനയ്ക്ക് മുന്നിൽ ഞാൻ ശിരസ് നമിക്കുന്നു സ്വതന്ത്ര ഭാരതത്തിലാണ് നാം ഇന്ന് ജീവിക്കുന്നത് വിവിധ ഭാഷകളും വിവിധ മതങ്ങളും ഉള്ള നമ്മുടെ രാജ്യം ലോകത്തെ ഏറ്റവും വലിയ ജനാധിപത്യ രാജ്യമാണ് ഒരൊറ്റ ഇന്ത്യ ഒരൊറ്റ ജനത എന്നായിരിക്കണം നമ്മുടെ മുദ്രാവാക്യം രാജ്യം കോവിഡ് മഹാമാരി പോലുള്ള പ്രസിദ്ധ പ്രതിസന്ധികളെ അതിജീവിച്ചു കൊണ്ടിരിക്കുകയാണ് ഇന്ന് നമ്മുടെ രാജ്യത്തിന്റെ അഭിമാന നിമിഷമാണ് രണ്ടായിരത്തി ഇരുപത്തൊന്നിലെ ഒളിമ്പിക്സിൽ ഭാരതീയർ സ്വർണം ഉൾപ്പെടെയുള്ള മെഡലുകൾ നേടി തന്നത് നമ്മുടെ കായിക രംഗത്തിന് അഭിമാനകരമാണ് നമ്മുടെ പൂർവികർ നേടി തന്ന സ്വാതന്ത്ര്യം കണ്ണിലെ കൃഷ്ണമണി പോലെ നമുക്ക് എന്നും കാത്തുസൂക്ഷിക്കാൻ കഴിയണം എന്നുള്ളതാണ് എനിക്ക് അവസരത്തിൽ പറയാനുള്ളത് രാജ്യപുരോധിക്കാക്കം കൂട്ടുന്ന ഉറച്ച തീരുമാനങ്ങൾ എടുക്കാനുള്ള അവസരമായി സ്വാതന്ത്ര്യ ദിനാഘോഷത്തെ കാണാം ഈ സ്വാതന്ത്ര്യ ദിനത്തിൽ ഡൽഹി പബ്ലിക് സ്കൂളിലെ പ്രിൻസിപ്പൾ ടീച്ചേഴ്സ് സ്റ്റുഡൻസ് പേരൻസ് മറ്റുള്ള എല്ലാവർക്കും ഈ സ്വാതന്ത്ര്യ ദിനത്തിന്റെ സന്തോഷം അറിയിച്ചുകൊണ്ട് കോവിഡ് പോലുള്ള മഹാമാരിയെ നമ്മളിൽ നിന്ന് തുടച്ചു നീക്കുന്നതിനുള്ള പ്രാർത്ഥന നടത്തിക്കൊണ്ട് അവസാനിപ്പിക്കുന്നു നന്ദി നമസ്കാരം ജയ്ഹിൻ May we request our principal Ms Abhiksha Tachi to address the gathering Good morning to the August gathering I wish each one of you a happy independence day We are gathered here to celebrate this festival of independence and to remember the sacrifices of the brave daughters and sons of India whose sacrifices and devotion allows us to breathe peacefully in an independent India today. We pay our respectful homage to the countless named and unnamed martyrs of this country who sacrificed their lives for the independence of the country. Many brave freedom fighters such as Chandra Shekhar, Maulana Abdul Kalam Azad, Subhas Chandra Bose, Bhagat Singh, Mahatma Gandhi, Khan Abdul Ghaffar Khan, Rani Lakshmi Bai, so many more fought for freedom throughout their lives to liberate our country. It is a day to salute the spirit of those soldiers who guard our lives by being deployed on the border and are always ready to sacrifice their lives. Max Müller had said, whatever the sphere of the human mind you may select for your special study whether it be language or religion or mythology or philosophy whether it be laws or customs primitive art or primitive science everywhere you go to india whether you like it or not because some of the most valuable and most instructive materials in the history of man are treasured up in india when such great men from other countries form such great opinion about our country it is also our duty to uphold ourselves in the international arena as india discovers herself again we need to augment on the value system we need to come together to develop a nation of harmony peace and development we need to build a legacy free from oppression prejudice and corruption dear children it is you who can do this it is you that we always bank on the next generation who can take and trust this country country to a better place so learn to be diligent and focused and set up a goal and look for role models to follow let us work hard with conviction to make this a better country our olympians have definitely made us proud with the best results so far may we march ahead with conviction this time new we hope you are safe and at present the pandemic is something which we have to overcome stay safe stay healthy jai hind thank you very much ma'am to celebrate this day of patriotism and nationalism here is a poem recited by pitan jain where the mind is without fear and the head is held high where knowledge is free where the world has not been broken up into fragments by narrow domestic walls where words come out from the depth of truth where tireless striving stretches its arm towards perfection where the clear stream of reason 
has not lost its way into the dairy desert sand of dead habit, where the mind is led forward by thee into ever widening thought and action, into the heaven of freedom. My father, let my country awake. Thank you, Vivan Jant, for reciting the beautiful poem by Rabindranath Tagore. Now we have Rian Ranish with a thought for the day. You must be the change you wish to see in the world. We should give soul to the universe, thanks to the mind, fly to the imagination, and charm and gaiety to life and to everything. Let's invite our friends to sing a song. Vande Madaram Vande Madaram Sujala Subala Haliya Chashi Bala Sisya Shamala Their tomorrows to answer a happy today's. A for Abaka Chanta, B for Bhagat Singh, C for Chandra Shekhar Azad, D for Dayanandu Saraswati, D for Rishul Chandra Vidya Sagar, F for Firosha Mehta, G for Gopala Krishna Gokile. H for Hebdarai I for Indian National Army J Chanchi Rani Lashmi Bai K for Kittu Rani Chalama L for Loga Mani Rudak M for Mahama Gandhi Ji N for Nedadi Subhas Chandra Bose O for Sona Sabawa P for Bandit to Madan Mohan Malviya R for Rabindranath Tagore S for Sardar Balavai Patel T for Tati Topi U for Udham Singh V for Viveka Nanda W for Vah Vatikish X for Savior Vasudev Bhatke Y for Yusuf Meher Ali Z for Zeenat Mahal
for the beautiful performance? May we invite our friend Naraya Susan Jones to say a few words on Independence Day. Good morning everyone. Freedom is a gift. It is a gift of sacrifices, sleepless nights, brutal tortures and struggles by our forefathers. Today, one part of our country to another part, everyone is chanting slogans of J. Bharat Mata with great spirit and energy. It is indeed the spirit of freedom and love for the land which makes us do so. But we know freedom is hard earned. We are gathered here today not only to chat slogans, also to do formalities. But our land needs more from us. Dear friends, let us unite and work hard for progress, peace and justice in our land. Jai Bharat, long live India. Thank you. May we wait with Hannah Burkis to propose good of thanks. Good morning everyone. It is my privilege to propose the vote of thanks on behalf of grade 3. I take this opportunity to express my sincere gratitude to our chief guest, Mr. Sanjay Kaur, for his valuable words of wisdom. I extend sincere thanks to our chairman, Mr. Abdul Aziz, who shared such wonderful words with us. We are fortunate to have Ms. Abhat Chatterjee as our school principal. Thank you, ma'am, for your expressive speech. I also would like to take this opportunity to thank the entire DPS column staff, students and parents without whom this assembly would have been incomplete. Thank you. Welcome back. Hope you enjoyed the program. Let's conclude today's celebration on a happy note. With immense pleasure, we inform you that our children, Isna Nazim and Ujjwal Naveen of Class 9, participated in the Freedom Quest competition organized and conducted by Kalam Sahodaya. There were 26 CBSE schools, and our children, Isna and Ujjwal, made us proud by winning the third position. Let's give them a loud round of applause. Thank you and we sign off.